Much of this village in southern India has been swept away by landslides. Emergency crews are hoping to find survivors, but they're also recovering lifeless bodies. Most people here have lost everything. In hospitals, survivors say the loss is overwhelming. My husband rescued me, my daughter and my mother. We thought our son would jump out, but the water was coming too fast and pushed him towards the kitchen. Then the house collapsed entirely. Some villagers flock to medical centers to identify the bodies of lost family members. Like many, Mohammed waits anxiously at a local clinic, hoping his family is still alive. My mother's brothers, my two uncles, their children and grandkids are missing. Several of my relatives, around 25 of them in all, are still missing. Schools have been turned into temporary shelters, housing survivors who have nowhere to go. I lost my son and my grandchild. The river swept them away. I don't have a life anymore. I have lost everything. Reaching the affected areas is a challenge. Homes were flattened by boulders and trees that were swept by landslides on Tuesday. What they are facing is a big problem of cutting into the houses which have collapsed. And for that they need uh, heavy equipment. At the moment we still are not in a position to transfer heavy equipment across the river. It's the worst disaster in the state of Kerala since 2018. The area is a tourist attraction known for its hills and breathtaking views. Now much of it is destroyed, covered in mud and debris. Katia Lopez Odoyan, Al Jazeera. Make sure to subscribe to our channel to get the latest news from Al Jazeera.